let's hear from our head judge, Len Goodman. If you don't get four tens for that, I'm going to go home and pick on my walnuts. <laughs> Known for his witty humour and charming critiques, Len Goodman was a recognisable face on and off the dance floor. I've got to say, Houston, we've got a problem here. I don't know about Hollywood, it was a bit upstairs, downstairs. <laughs> Since the show's launch in 2004, he spent 12 years waving his paddle as the head judge on Strictly Come Dancing. From Len! A 10 from Len was what the dancers were always waiting for, but the millions watching at home knew him best for... Seven! Seven! Six! After more than a decade in the chair, he took his final steps to the Strictly Dance floor in 2016. We are going to miss you so, so terribly. What are you going to miss most about the show? I, I will miss everything about the show, I, I, I promise you. It, I, I'll miss just turning up and the anticipation of what's going to occur. I will miss what I consider the three best judges on television and any of these type of shows. But it wasn't just this dance floor where Len made his mark. He also appeared on the US version of the show, Dancing with the Stars. Len hasn't always been sat behind the judging table. He originally wanted to be a footballer, but began dancing after a doctor told him it would be good exercise for his injured foot. He went on to win various competitions. Since then, his high kicks and scores have left a legacy at the historic Blackpool Tower Ballroom. I couldn't believe it. I heard it on the radio and Len Goodman thought, my word, he's been, you know, coming here so many years dancing into the ballroom and I was on my way to play today, you know, here in the ballroom. And uh, it was just so sad to hear that news. Well, my memories of it, like, when he's been here in the past, he's, he's coming, obviously, he's, um, we've had a lot of dancers and regular dancers, and they've all been dancing. He's come and he's made, an, you know, he goes round to people, asking them to come on the floor and have a dance with him dancing, and uh, it's wonderful atmosphere, the, the times he's been in here. Margaret and Robert have been dancing together for over 30 years. It's just a sad loss, really, to ball around dancing. Is you know, right? his influence. Yeah, yeah, you'd always have a chat about, about dancing and it, it, it keep it simple as well, you know. And it, it did encourage people to have a go, really, and enjoy it. From old friends to strictly judges, tributes have been pouring in from the world of show business and beyond. Close friend and colleague Bruno Tonioli said, I will treasure the memories of our adventures on Strictly Come Dancing. You will always be my perfect ten. Craig Revel Horwood called him a gorgeous colleague and a dear friend. It's a 10 from Len, he said, that would live with him forever. And Strictly Come Dancing co-host Claudia Winkleman said he was one of a kind, a brilliant and kind man and full of twinkle, warmth and wit. A career spanning six decades, his easygoing charm made Len Goodman as natural on TV as it did on the dance floor. Bradley Harris, 5 News.